47 million Americans expected to travel for at least 50 miles for Thanksgiving. And if you think traffic is bad in Central Texas, you're right. KXN's Lauren Kravitz live along H35 in Austin with what you can expect for our holiday travel, Lauren. Well, yeah, we're actually just north of Austin right now near the Williamson County border, but a lot of people will be going through Austin to get to their Thanksgiving destination. Taking a look at traffic right now, we did see a lot of backup on the ramp on 45 behind me, but it looks like it just cleared up and uh, makes sense because experts say the best times to travel are going to be this evening or even tomorrow on Thanksgiving Day. So you want to get out there now. Unfortunately, more drivers on the road. That means more accidents. The National Safety Council estimates that more than 400 people will be killed and more than 52,000 seriously injured in car crashes during the Thanksgiving holiday period. And that actually starts tonight and ends on Sunday night. Now, some drivers I spoke with today say they try to avoid those risks and traffic by going around I-35. If I can get off the main road by either using the toll road or some parallel way into Austin, I will definitely use that. Now, talking about the report, the worst spot for traffic in Austin is I-35 between Riverside and Dean Keaton Street. So if you want to avoid that jam when you're coming home from Thanksgiving plans, they say the best days to travel back, that's going to be Saturday for you or early Monday morning. They say to definitely try to avoid Sunday afternoon if possible, because that's when we're going to see the most traffic. For now, we're live in Williamson County, Lauren Kravitz, KXAN News. Despite the surge in traffic, Thanksgiving is far from the busiest time of year for DPS troopers. We checked the data to see when troopers made the most traffic stops. The week of Independence Day in July topping the list. Last year, troopers stopped more than 68,000 drivers in the week around that holiday. Labor Day weekend came in second on the list with more than 53,000 stops by troopers. Thanksgiving week was far behind, ending up at 32nd on the DPS list. Troopers stopped more than 35,000 drivers last year. That's thousands fewer stops than the Christmas week, spring break, even Mother's Day weekend. 